can stay with me for life. We can watch TV or just chill and drink tea, yo. Right, now, we need, I need, whoever's going first. For me, what's special about the CDI project is, is, is the feeling of community that you get down here. You know, in a lot of places, there's a whole, there's a whole issue about, you know, youth crime and post-cold beefs and all of this kind of stuff that, that are affecting the young people these days. Why is it got to be like this? Yeah. To press but still bless, no rest. I got a tortured soul. Genius in my way, no case. I need to gain control. To be something extraordinary. Don't know why I'm on my mind. See, it's, it's just live to motivate people into doing music and that. Cause I want to get more mixtape out there and if it inspires someone else to come to the studio and make some more tunes and Imagine a future where two young people are lining up to vote. Imagine a future of where children and young people's rights are being respected. Because children and young people can't vote, it's even more important to have loads of different ways for children and young people to have their views taken into account when decisions are being made about their everyday lives. I'm Karim Khan and I'm a young filmmaker. This is my film. I want you to hear about your voices, your views and your rights. We all love sweet snacks. But how much sugar are we eating? And what is it doing to us? I had a cake, biscuits, popcorn, donuts, sweets, warm chocolate mousse, definitely chocolate, 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 two chocolate mousses, ice cream, <laughs> boy chocolate bars, chocolate ice cream. So, why is eating too much sugar bad for us? When you get older, it can lead to diabetes and obesity, and it can also damage your teeth. You'll get really fat when you eat um, too much sugar. And it could proper damage your teeth. In order to establish how students learn best, we need to understand where students learn best. Three young reporters have been researching ways in which Oxfordshire schools have been created for using small amounts of money to improve their environment and enhance learning. Let's see what they found. Hi, I'm Nadia. I'm here at Cooper School Vista. Looks pretty ordinary from the outside, but inside it's a different story. Come, let's check it out. The New Oxford Wheels Project Park was built in uh, earlier this year in April, finally opened after about 13 years of hard work. So we've got about 1,000 square metres of skatable concrete. 